Greetings, it's Pastor Weaver coming to you today from the Atherton Church here in the greater metropolitan Los Angeles area. And so just coming to you with your word for the week. Uh, I do this word for the week to try to give you a word of encouragement, a word of support, a word that will make you think as you start your week off. Uh, hopefully it's thought provoking. Uh, hopefully it's a support system something for you to learn the word of God, to know the word of God, and to live within the will of God. So the word for this week is the word given. The word for this week is given, given. I want to read this from the New American Standard uh, Bible and it reads there in James chapter 1 and verse 17. It says, every good thing given and every perfect gift is from above, coming down from the Father of lights, with whom there is no variation or shifting shadow. What this says to us, James writes here, is that all the gifts that we have, all the things that we are receiving, they are given. They are given from God. We can't buy them. We can't manipulate our way around them. Uh, we can't force our way to receive them. Uh, our heritage has nothing to do with them, uh, who your parents were or what your class is or what your nationality. None of that. These things are given from God. Every good, every perfect gift is given from God. It comes down from him. And so I think for us as people of God, we need to recognize, we need to realize that surely as undeserving as we are because of what we do so often and how we do things and for God to bless us and give us the things that he gives us surely is an act of a loving God. So I want to say to you on this week, humble yourself and recognize uh, you didn't make it on your own. Uh, you didn't accomplish the things that you've accomplished on your own. Uh, your education, uh, maybe the material possessions that you have, the family, the wife, the children, uh, all the other things, the wisdom that you have, uh, the knowledge that you have, uh, they're gifts from God. God has given us every good and every perfect gift. It comes from him. So I want to remind you on this week, as you think about all God has done for you, Give him praise because he's given you quite a bit. Health and strength and life and so many other things. You got a reason to give him glory. The word for this week is given.